everybody, nothing but Rodney here. Welcome to Our Wilds. I have no idea what this game is all about. I basically saw like three or four screenshots, but other than that, I haven't seen anything. Okay, so I'm playing with me controller. I don't know what will happen. I don't know what it will be like. It was recommended to me to play it with me controller. So let's go with new expedition. Oh, hello. What the fuck is going on up there? Alright. Hey, buddy. Why are you sad? So it's lunch day, huh? Seems like only yesterday you joined the space program and suddenly here you are, living on your first solo voyage. What do you say? Ready to get this beauty off the ground? It's all fueled up and ready to go. You're sure you fixed the retro rockets? It was only problem one time and then maybe a few times after that. But hey, no reasons to dwell on the past, right? Anyway, you'll need to get the launch codes from Hornfels at the observ observatory before you can lift off. Just bring those here once you've said your goodbyes or whatever. This is the rocket, right? Oh my god, look at that. That's gorgeous. So I will be hold and release so I can jump higher. Oh, that's so nice. Okay, I'm not used to play with a controller, but hey, Mika, hey, it's you. It is me, Slater. You're blasting off in your ship today. I'm really excited to see the launch. Aren't you gonna go into space, aren't you? You better not have changed your mind. I hear you at Slade beefed up the model ship. Can I see it? Yeah, we calibrated the controls and installed better thrusters. Want to give it a test drive? Slade says it's just like the real thing, only less likely to start a fire. Try to land on one of the geyser pools. Show me what you got. Okay, so this is the test launch. Flying model ship. Yeah, here we go. Let's give it a shot. Oh. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh my god. Oh, that's bad. Oh, okay. Oh, I fucked it up already. I cannot fucking control that thing. It is so difficult. How the f- Oh, okay. I did not expect it would be that difficult to control this shit. Oh, oh. How you guys doing? You're looking sad. Am I the same looking as you are? Uh, hello astronaut. What's with the radio? We wanted to play hide and seek, but Moraine won't let us borrow their single scope because it's really delicate and not supposed to be thrown around like that. Hey, hey, can we use your single scope? Can we, can we please, we'll even let you be it. Ah, uh, sure, let's play. Woohoo! Okay, here are the rules. Jelena and me will hide with these radios, and you'll use your single scope to find us. Last one to be found wins. Okay, close your eyes and start counting. All right, let's, let's play a little game, shall we? Equip single scope. Uh, where the fuck are you guys? Oh, oh, here we go. I think I found you. I think I found you. Where you are, huh? Oh, you sneaky little bastard. Are you up there? You definitely up there, huh? Aren't ya? Okay, so let me let me go around and let me find you. And where is the other one? Oh, the other one's some Oh, there you are. I can see you. Oh, you you didn't hide that well. Hey, oh, you found me. My hiding spot was super good. Now it wasn't. Don't forget, you have to find both of us, okay? Right. How the f fuck am I supposed to get out of here? Alright, this way it is. Okay, it's not, that wasn't that big of a deal. Okay, you don't have to be hiding there anymore. I, I found you, so... And the other one is over here somewhere. I know it. Oh, here you are. I, I know it. I, I won? I'm happy. Thanks for playing with us. Yeah, you're welcome. You don't have to be here anymore. Look at that. Am I able to actually visit these planets? Is that a thing? Hello, Moraine. Mmm, oh, hello, astronaut. This is good weather for your lunch, right? That's lucky. 
What are you up to? I'm using my single scope to pick up sounds from distant planets. It's set to Outer Wilds Venture frequency, so I can pick up the Traveler's music. Last night I heard Rebecca's banjo coming from Brit Hollow. I hope that means they're safe. I can hear different planets too. It depends on what time of day or night it is, since different planets are in the sky at different times. Single scopes are cool. Can I use that as well? Oh my god! That is so cool! So that means that somebody's there playing... What is that? I don't know how do you call it in English. Oh yeah, and somebody on this planet as well. Okay, so let me explore. I wanna, I wanna go to the space. Oh, I really wanna go to the space now. I can, I can meet people and... Stuff. This is exciting. What is in that cave there? Zero G cave. Oh, that's important, I guess. I, uh, then I will be able to practice, maybe? Hey, I thought I might see you before the big lunch. Nerves get in the better of you, huh? Are you kidding me? I'm natural at this. Fuck yeah. Is that so funny? I seem to recall the first time you strapped on a jetpack. We had to come fish you out of the crater near the South Pole. So listen, there is a satellite, which is definitely not just a piece of broken mining equipment, set up down in the zero-g cave and in need of repairs. If you're looking for a little last minute zero-g practice, head down the lift and into the cave. One repaired satellite's coming up. Oh my goodness. This is amazing. This is looking like a fucking space. Flat. Yeah, yeah, let's turn. Oh, look at that. It's so fascinating. So nice. Okay, so the zero G, zero G cave. Do I have to suit up? Yep. There we go. Okay, look at that. What is that? Return suit. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I can repair now, but I cannot see shit though. So here is like no gravity at all. So I can, oh, there are the repairs. Okay, let me check that. Nice, nice, nice. Match velocity, hold to repair. That's fixed. Okay, I am practicing. I'm getting better. Oh, nice. Now one more. Where is that? Oh, is it inside here? Yes, it is here. Okay. Oh, stop. Stop right here and repair it. You can do it. Nice. Training simulation complete. So can we go to space now? Oh, what? Nicely done, of course. It'll be a little more stressful when you're hurtling through space. But just remember your training and try not to hit anything big. I can see you're itching to get off this rock, so go get the launch codes from the observatory. Hello. Read. Autowilds Ventures founding members. Clockwise from top left, Hornfels, Gossen, Slate and Feldspar. This remarkably intact statue was carved by, by the Nomai, an ancient species who dwelt in our solar system thousands of years ago. The statue provides us with our most detailed look yet at the Nomai who appeared to have been covered with layer of fur. Note the decorative jewelry that has been carved as part of the antlers. Although their artifacts and structures have been found on almost every planet in the solar system, we still have no idea where this species came from or what happened to them. Oh my god. This game is gorgeous. There you are. I just finished pre-flight observations and local conditions are good. Time to get our newest astronaut off the ground. And you'll be our first astronaut ever equipped with no my translated tool. I confess I've been giddy all day just thinking about it. We're better equipped than ever to unravel the mysteries of no my you and, and Hal should be very proud of your work. I'm gonna wing it. Planning to follow in the footsteps of 
feldspar and the great Otto Wilds Ventures tradition, are you? I might have guessed. Well, see if you can put that translator tool of yours to good use while you're out there. Looks like all that left is to send you off. All in all, it's fine day for a lunch. I'm ready to die in space. Yeah, that's pretty accurate. I'm not one of four superstition, but isn't that kind of unlucky to say before a lunch? At any rate, here are the lunch codes. So I have the code now. All right, lunch code. I can see it. So I can go. I can go to space and die. <laughs> <laughs> That'll be fun. This way it is. Oh. Okay, that's creepy. That's very creepy. What the fuck? Oh my god, what the fuck is going on? Yes, I, I, I did that. Alright. Why did that happen? Why, why did that happen? What the fuck was that all about? That was weird. But okay, I guess. Hey buddy, hey hey! So did you get a good look at the Nomai statue? The statue looked at me and opened its eyes. Whoa, whoa, the statue was doing what? So its eyes opened and then you saw images from your own memories and glowing lights flying around? You mean like a hallucination? Listen, no offense, but are you sure you're okay to lunch, like medically speaking? No, the statue is definitely weird. I mean, if you're saying it happened, then I guess maybe it did, but why? Onfields try everything to get the statue eyes to open and nothing like this ever happened to them. I don't think you're going to get any answers from the museum statue, but Gabro said that they were going back to Giants Deep. Don't know which island they're on though. Maybe they'd be able to tell you more. On the other hand, Gabro's, you know, Gabro. So maybe you'd be better off searching for more info on your own. Jeez, now I'm really jealous you're going into space. Hey, see if you can use our translated tool to find out more about the statue, okay? Good luck and safe flying. Oh, I'll definitely do me best to find out more about that statue. Hmm. Oh, this is beautiful, guys. Oh, look at that fireplace. I'm back here now. So let's fucking go. Let's not waste any more time. I think I saw the village. I'm going up. I'm going into the space. Holy shit, this is scary. Oh, I will definitely die. But I'm okay with that. Oh, I'm okay with that. Oh my god. Oh my god, this is so great. Oh, this is great. I love this. What is that? Is that like the thing that will power up the, the station? View ship lock. Okay, so I'm here, right? View entries. Village, that's one of my ads. Zero G cave. The one and only Herthian village, as well as the main source of explosions on this planet. The Nomai statue in the observatory opened its eyes and looked at me. I saw strange glowing lights and my own memories flashed before my eyes. Hal says the statue has never opened its eyes before, despite Hornfell's best efforts. Hal says Gabro went back to Giant's Deep to try to learn more about the Nomai statue in the observatory. Oh my god, this is so amazing. I am supposed to visit the whole solar system. This is nuts! Okay, we are about to have a great adventure. All right, so let's launch. Buckle up. All right, I buckled up. Lift off. All right. Let's go. I can do this. Oh, hey, folks. All right, let's not crash. I don't know. Oh, okay. Oh, the gravity is real. Oh, I'm going back. Okay, okay, the gravity is real. Alright, am I off now? Am I in the space now? How's my fuel? Do I have a fuel? Okay, let's lock to this. Oh my god, this is so amazing! I love this. Oh look, there's the there's the sunshine. There's the sun. There's the big fucking ball of fire. I'm not going there. Let me let me actually go here. So let me reach that. Oh, I am gaining speed very quickly. Holy shit. 
Oh, oh, no, 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 no. I don't know how to control this thing yet. Can I visit this? I don't know if that's... Oh, that's not a good idea. Oh, that's not a good idea. I don't know if I should... Oh, oh, oh. I'm, I'm scared. Oh, I'm real scared. Okay, I'm coming closer. Can I... Can I actually... I don't know... Oh, what is... What the fuck just happened? Did I go through that planet? There wasn't planet or... What the fuck just happened? Well, I don't know what just happened. That thing just disappeared. Yes, yes, that's the planet that I was on. Oh my god, holy crap. So can I actually <laughs> land somewhere? What the fuck was that? I went through that gas... It was like a gas ball or something. Maybe I wasn't supposed to go there at all. Okay, so what we have here... Alright, so I can match velocity. Which is good. Okay, let me let me actually visit this planet if I can. View map. Oh my goodness! There is an actual map! So I match the velocity. But how can I like turn? How can I land? Oh I'm so scared. Oh, oh no no no. Can I just stop moving and Oh, I landed. I landed. Good. So let me take my suit and let me go out. Can I open the hatch? Yes, I can. I'm outside now. Oh, good. Oh, this is so fascinating. Refuel jetpack. Play recording. Church research now. Property of church. This is an old crater. The neat thing here is that the Position of the samples I took from the impact site matches the composition of the ice on the outskirts of dark Brubble brumble. I posit the Atle rock was hit with piece of the planet that used to be where dark brumble was now lies The follow-up on maybe there are more fragments of the old planet dark brumble destroyed on other astral bodies in the solar system. If I will go too far, will I lose the gravity of this meteorite or our moon or whatever it is? My O2 is getting low and low. Oh, here we go. What we have here? Oh my god, slow down. So what is this? Read. Esker single scope lock. Day 48, still not picking up rebags. Benjo from Brittle Hollow. I'm sure they're fine, but I'll feel better once I can hear their music. Day 51. Listen to church play for a while today. Unrelated. Someone should tell Porphy and Gosen their flirting is not subtle from an aerial perspective. Day 55. Banjo music coming in loud and clear today. Sounds like Rebeck's doing okay. Day 63. Today I thought I heard something strange. I don't know. It was probably nothing. No, it's back again today too. Something strange is coming from Timberheart. Day 76. Okay, I know this is crazy, but the sound from Timberheart sounds exactly like Feldspar's harmonica. But Feldspar disappeared in space ages ago. It can be them. Day 88. It's still here. This is creepy. Maybe my single scope is broken i'd better talk to gnis undefined signal nearby is it like close oh it is close it sounds like a banjo oh here we go look at you guys oh there's an oxygen here nice hey esker hey it's you Ground control didn't tell me you were launching. Long time no see. Actually, I guess it's been a long time since I've seen anyone. Don't the other travelers come by? The lunar outpost saw more traffic back when our ships were less sophisticated and needed more frequent repairs. Nowadays, it's mostly used to keep a set of eyes on things. Sometimes Chert comes by and say hi, but Gobro is Gabro, and you know how Reback feels about Unnecessary space flight. Seemed lonely up here. A little, I'm in touch with ground control, Hornfels and Gossen mostly, and they radio up to chat now and then. And when ground control forgets I'm up here, and they usually do, I launch my little scout at the village. You spy on us? What? No, no, it's not spying, it's, 
It's one-way communication that none of the villagers know about because I've never told them. Was that you whistling? Probably. Um, or actually, definitely. The other travelers carry instruments so they don't bother whistling. You can pick up their music with Signoscope. Best spot for that is the North Pole. Great reception. The North Pole is marked in red on your minimap, but the Atle Rock is pretty small moon. Really, just go north. You can't miss it. What is this place? <laughs> Very funny. Oh, stars above. You're serious, aren't you? Uh, this is just pressing. <sighs> Welcome to Lunar Outpost, which apparently the space program doesn't bother to teach anyone anymore. When the first started other wilds, travelers used to bring their ships here all the time for repairs. Our spacefaring technology has improved loads since then, but the older ships tended to uh, fall apart a lot, like more than they do now. Using the outpost cut down on the number of lunches and landing taking place in the village and also the number of fires. Nowadays though it's mostly just me up here raising samplings from Timberheart and keeping an eye on things. Alright, talk to you later Esker. Talk to you later. Roast marshmallow. What? I can roast marshmallow? Move stick, put away, extend stick. Alright, it's done. Eat it. Hmm, delicious. So what we have over here. Okay, what the fuck is this place? What, what, what? What the fuck am I doing? Can I, can I put that thing over here? Oh my god, what is going on? What did I just do? Why did I do that? Trees detected, oxygen tank refilled. What the? Untranslated, no my writing. I was upstairs testing the eye signal locator and it can hear and follow the signals from the sun, giants deep, the brittle hollow and brittle hollow. However, something strange is happening when I ask the eye signal locator to follow the eyes. Wait, wait, wait. Follow the eye signal. The device indicator rotates wildly and never points to just one direction. Yeah, that's what's happening now. I see, I most likely carbureted the locator incorrectly, private my apprentice and I will make adjustments and try again. This is a curious result, it's possible that the eye has stopped calling out its signal. An update, disappointingly everything is correctly calibrated after all. It saddens me to posit this, my friends, but I believe we need to build a more sophisticated device if we want to find the exact location of the eye of the universe. Then we will build it, don't lose hope. Kasava, our search for the eye is what brought our clan to this place. We won't give up so easily. All right, there's more. What is that? Pick up scroll? Why did I pick it up? Insert scroll. Where should, where should this new, more sophisticated locator be built? It may need to be larger than this eye signal locator is. Anona and those of us originally stranded on the Ember Twin built a quantum moon locator there. But the heat of the sun made its construction challenging. I wouldn't recommend building on that planet. The sudden glacier, glacier on Brittle Hollow has ample available space i could construct a new building the house this proposed locator yes let's build there i imagine our young friend kanoi would enjoy that immensely he's always held a great interest in the eye especially for a child born so long after the crash i will begin construction on a brittle hollow south pole immediately then then what Then what? What the fuck is going on? Trees detected, oxygen tank refilled. Okay, so if I come close to trees, my oxygen will... Oh my god, my fucking controller is going wild. What is going on? 
What the fuck just happened? What is going on? Why do why am I having these flashbacks? What? Did I die? What? Hold on, you're going to want to get lunch codes from the observatory? How did I get back here? Didn't I already lift off? Trust me, with the modification I made to those rockets, there's no way I would have missed that. I won't ask how you got the lunch codes, but since you have them, get a move on. I want to see whether the new cockpit stays attached during lift off. How did I get back here? Oh, I'm so confused. What is all this? What? The Nomai decided to build larger, more sophisticated eye signal locator on Brittle Hollow's south pole. Nomai device created a pinpoint source of distant signals. The Nomai were disappointed by their failure to detect the signal from something called the Eye of the Universe. There is more to explore here. That confused me so much. Let, let's go back to where I was. Can somebody explain me what the fuck just happened? Are, is this the same text that before? Yeah, this is all the same. Okay, wow, wow, I've seen the ruin in other travelers picture, but seeing it for myself is really old, isn't it? But wow, this is the coolest day of my life. Okay, um, time for some official notes. So this is some kind of Nome locator. It can point out the different planets, which is incredibly cool, by the way. I'm not sure I was able to translate something about the South Pole of Brill Hollow. I'll fly there to see if I can learn more. Just gonna get back in the old ship and take off. Totally safe, mostly safe. Oh, stars above. So that was the last thing. I was I was confused for a moment if I if I checked this one before or not. So this was the last thing that I haven't checked yet. All right, so in the next episode, we are about to visit Brittle Hollow. I wonder what that will be like. So we are about to have a big adventure. Oh, I'm, I'm excited about this one. I'm very interested what is going on. The whole fucking place looking so big and I just love space and wandering around. This is amazing. This is, this is one heck of a journey. Good. Okay, thank you everybody so much for watching. Leave a like or a comment. What do you think about this? I appreciate your time very much and I will see you in the next one. Ciao.